Hello everyone, it's Heidi and welcome to today's baby name list. If you are new here or this is the very first video of mine that you are watching, every single week I upload baby names list here on YouTube to hopefully inspire those who are looking for names. Now make sure you guys hit that subscribe button down below, make sure you hit the bell notification as well right beside it so you never miss a names list. So for today's list, it's going to be another astrology names list. So another zodiac sign we are going to be touching on today is Taurus baby. Taurus season actually starts this Tuesday, so April 20th, and runs all the way until May 20th. And it's really fun because my daughter, Zayla, is actually a Taurus baby born on May 16th. So this is just so perfect. Now, to start off with some character traits, which I normally start off with, if you guys are not a Taurus, if you're not born in the Taurus season, these names are so great. They're so powerful, very soft and gentle, and full of nature and kind of luxury. So Taurus babies are represented by the bull. Extremely loyal but crave security. Their element sign is Earth and their ruling planet is Venus. Now Venus is the planet that governs love, beauty, natural beauty, and money. For Taurus babies, they love nature. They also love relaxation. You'll find a Taurus baby sitting on a tropical beach in the sand, in tune with nature, very relaxed, very chill. They love sweet and gentle, soft sounds, sweet aromas, and they're just very gentle, very comforting, and very compassionate. All right, so now moving on into some names as I move on into the gemstones. April's birthstone is diamond, and then May's birthstone is emerald. And the emerald gemstone actually represents the seeker of love, totally makes sense, and the revealer of truth. And then as for flowers, representing a Taurian, there was actually three that I saw and read on. So there's a poppy, which is so sweet, represents compassion, love, and natural beauty. There's also roses, representing that love, that very kind of emotional side of a Taurian. And then violet flowers. Moving on into my list that I compiled here for you guys, first name on the list is a girl's name, and that's the name Golda, spelled G-O-L-D-A. Golda. Now Golda is actually both an English and Yiddish originated name meaning gold obviously. It's such a super sweet vintage option but it gives that a luxurious feel with that meaning of gold. I also feel like Golda would be a great more unique alternative to like Goldie for instance. Like everybody's loving Goldie right now. Just switch that IE to A on the end still means the same. Now if you love gold as a meaning on the boy side I have the name Orion. So A-U-R-I-A-N, Orion. Now this one's a Latin originated name meaning gold. So they both have the exact same meaning there. Maybe siblings. I have quite a few options here that would be great for siblings. And this one is very similar to like Adrian or Dorian I added on here, but it's currently completely unranked and has been since 2019. Another boys option here on the list that actually brings out that really compassionate side of a Torian is the name Jabari. So J-A-B-A-R. R I Jabari. So this one's actually a Swahili originated name meaning comforter or bringer of consolation. I also did see that it means brave as well. So for a little boy, Jabari. Ooh, this one is super handsome. It's actually just outside the top 1000s as you guys can see and it has remained pretty stable right there. So I don't see it entering the top 1000s whatsoever. So speaking of sibling names, moving on over to the girl side, I feel like this would be a perfect girl sibling for Jabari. Now this is the name Jada, spelled J-A-E-D-A, -E Jada. Loving the spelling with this one, and it's an Arabic originated name meaning long-necked beauty. Now long neck in a lot of cultures on the complete opposite side of the world here than North America believe that a long neck is a big symbol for beauty, natural beauty. So I thought that was just so wonderful and so interesting to see what different cultures around the world kind of has beauty in their mind, what their form of beauty is. So Jada represents that absolute beauty and natural beauty behind a little Taurus girl. All right, so back over to the boy side, I have a very short but edgy name here for you, and that's the name Seb, spelled S-E-B, Seb. I have been loving these short, like Jed, Jeb, 
Seb. I don't know, they just sound so cool. And Seb was actually the Egyptian god of the earth. So representing that element sign, it has that natural nature, earthy feel to it, but it also for a boy symbolizes power. An S name here now over for the girl side, I have the name Sarah Lee, spelled S-A-R-A-L-E-E. -E. Now this one's a great kind of combining mix of Sarah and Lee, and together it means a meadow of the princess. So so again, it has a very earthy feel to it. Really gorgeous princess with that luxury rich feeling of a Taurus baby as well. So I thought this was great, even for sibling names, Seb and Sarah Lee. I think those flow so well together and I love how all of these are just really great sibling names as well. Next on the list here, I have the name Layan. Spell L-A-Y-A-N, Layan. Now this one is a really great gender neutral, genderless option here. Whether you're having a surprise baby or just want something super neutral. I think this is so sweet and it's Arabic originated meaning soft and gentle. On the girl side here, this one is so beautiful. I actually got it from my girl Lilia over on Instagram. She's also a namer. I'll have her Instagram link down below. She is so great. So she recently uploaded the name Ivara. Spelled E-V-A-R-A, -A, Ivara. So this one's a beautiful Sanskrit originated name meaning romantic beauty, but for a girl, it also means brave. So this is just so wonderful, especially with that ruling planet Venus, symbolizes that just beauty, that goddess of a girl, but it also has that bravery and that courage behind her. Back over on the boys' side, another option I have here for you guys, which I am in love with, is the name Sias. Spell S-I-A-S, Sias. Yes, very similar to like Silas, but without that L, Sias. Now this one's a Greek originated name, meaning from the woods. I feel like this one could also be genderless, a little bit of a tomboy sounding girl's name, Sias. I think it's just too cool. Then for a Z name on the girl's side, oh, love this one as well, and that's the name Zaria. So Z-A-R-I-A, -A, Zaria. Like how gorgeous can you get? And this is actually a floral name. It's Arabic originated, meaning rose. And roses, like I said, are a symbol of love, but they are also the flower that represents a Taurus. Next name here on the list is actually a recently found favorite of mine. I think it's too cool. So this is the name Huntley. So H-U-N-T-L-E-Y, Huntley. So maybe an alternative to Hunter, you have Huntley, a little bit more softer and this one's an English originated name meaning meadow of the hunter. All right I actually have another Arabic originated name here. I love all the different origins I have on this list. So this one here is the name Riaz. Spelled R-I-A-Z. Riaz. And like I said it's an Arabic originated name meaning meadows or gardens. Really soft again with the meaning that earthy feel. I love the sound of this name. It's also another recently found name, just like Huntley, but Riaz. I don't know, with that ending there, I think it's so incredibly handsome. Then as for a four letter name, but on the girl side, I have the name Alda. So A-L-D-A, Alda. This is another one that is totally new to me, and it's actually a Teutonic name meaning rich and wise, which again, Taurus babies, they love to live that luxurious lifestyle. They work hard for it, but live life comfortably, luxurious, and they're very smart with their money. Moving on to a surname sounding name here on the boy side, I have the name Denim but spelled D-E-N-H-A-M, Denim. Now this one's an old English originated name, surname, meaning homestead in the valley. Love the meaning, again, another earthy tone name, but I love the spelling of this one. I think it's a great alternative to, instead of spelling it denim, like denim jeans, you can do denim with that H-A-M ending, which is very trendy right now. This is definitely a unique ham ending name. A couple T names here next for the boy side. I have the name Terran, so T-E-R-R-A-N, and this one's an Old English originated name meaning from the earth, Terran, almost like terrain, but a little bit more usable. Then for a T name on the girl side, totally representing a Taurus baby, this is the name Tora. So T-A-U-R-A, Tora. Very similar to like a mixture of Taurus and Laura put together. I knew a few of you guys would love this one and it has such a powerful meaning for a girl. It's Latin originated, meaning like a bull. And again, Taurus babies are represented by the bull symbol. So this one's perfect. 
A few more names here left on the list. Next one here, three letters for a girl. I have the name Alu, spelled A-L-U, Alu. I really hope I'm pronouncing this right, but it's actually the name of the Taurus constellation back in ancient times, Alu, and it switched over to Taurus, which I thought was just too crazy, but such a sweet sounding name, Alu. Very sweet and gentle. I don't know, I love the sound of it. Then I have the name Edlin. So E-D-L-Y-N, Edlin. Another trendy E name option. This one is totally way down the charts. I'm pretty sure this one was actually unranked and it's Old English originated, meaning rich, but a gentle woman. Second to last name on the list, I have the name Sela. So S-E-E-L-A, Sela. I love this name. I love so many on this list, I know, but this one is one of my favorites, Sela. So beautiful. And this one's actually both Finnish and Hebrew originated, meaning rock. And then that brings me to my final name on the list here. And this is a boy's name, and that's the name Tyrus. Spelled T-Y-R-U-S, Tyrus. Personally, I can totally see Tyrus and Taryn being like boy sibling names. I think that would be just really cool and edgy sounding. And Tyrus, which is a Phoenician, which I really hope I'm pronouncing that right. Yeah, Phoenician name meaning rock. So it also could be a really great sibling name with Sela as they both mean rock. And Tyrus is totally like a mixture of Tyrone and Cyrus. Put together, you have Tyrus, nicknamed Ty. Oh. I love that one. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this list of Taurus inspired names here for your little ones. Even if you aren't a Taurus baby, they all work for anyone. I love the meanings. I love how unique the names were as well. And if you are a Taurus baby or you're having a Taurus baby, comment in the comments below. Let me know maybe when you were due or when your birthday was. I think that would be so cool. And maybe what your name is. Maybe your name is Taurus inspired and you didn't even know. So I hope the sun is shining for you guys because it's definitely shining for me. Take care, stay safe. Make sure you guys are staying safe out there. And I will see you guys next Sunday with another baby names list. Bye.